Hey, it's Koro. Welcome back to the dead world. To I almost said the dead world. Anyway, I'm sitting here in my very uh, cold office uh, with my hoodie on over my head. So I'm going no cam today and we're picking up with dead world and I accidentally loaded the game before I started recording. So we're already here. So yeah, obviously very hungry. Uh, I know I was immediately about to do something. But I don't remember what... I think I was going to Trappers, so... We'll just, uh, I think we came here to search for anything good. I think I just took a little nap for the save. We're obviously very cold. Uh, and yeah, we're tired, but we're okay. And hungry, as usual. So yeah, let's continue on the journey to Trappers. How are you? I hope you're good. I can turn my stream light off, I don't know why that's on. I think it's just a habit that I turn that on. I have got all my neons going, but that's mainly for my own ambience rather than yours. They're always on, whether I'm streaming or not. They're all on a one switch, though. They, uh, they're they either on or off. There's no individual switches that I'm flicking for all of them. Though, actually, that multi-box... No, it doesn't. I was going to say, I think that multi-box has individual switches, but it does not. It just has a switch on the box itself, which is what I use to turn everything on or everything off. Any hoodle. We're going to Trappers, and uh, we're going to be nosy as we go down the hill here. I could go to the helicopter and see if there's anything there. And she's tired, which I relate to. I'm always tired at the moment. I've spent the last day and a bit trying to work out <laughs> our budget because I uh, missed a bill this month and next month out of our budget. And that means that we are short. But not so short that we'll, you know, starve, but just frustratingly short when we were supposed to be having a little surplus. No longer will we have a surplus. So we'll survive, but it's frustrating. Um, I'm pretty I'm pretty good at budgets. I'm pretty detail oriented. But yeah, I I also work in advance. Oh, have I been up here already? I don't remember coming up here. Maybe I did. Um I'm also yeah, I work in advance and um I put in budget uh regular monthly costs up for quite a long time up to a certain point and then when I say I usually put a little note in my budget saying I've budgeted this account to here because I don't know if we're continuing with that service or not. And, uh, I did not budget for our dog, uh, a, do a monthly dog cost, which is annoying because the dog will still exist and she will still want, uh, <laughs> she will still want, uh, daycare, unfortunately. It's one day a week that my husband and I are both out of the house every single week. And so we switched her to having daycare that day. Sorry, my mouse is really sensitive. I think it might, I might've actually hit the setting. On the side of it. No, that's too slow. Is there like an in between? That's too slow. That's a little bit better. Yeah, I think I actually hit the button that changes the sensitivity, and that was part of my problemo. Uh, so yeah, so she goes to a little dog daycare where she can run around with other dogs and get some exercise and have some fun and not be uh inside the house wondering when we're coming home and being sad. So. We have been doing that for as long as she's, we've basically as long as she's been old enough to be on the house on her own. And, uh... I don't know why I only budgeted up to a certain point. But anyway, that is a first world, real world problem you guys don't need to worry about. But that's basically, I was telling you that because it's been the bulk of my weekend so far. Uh, sorting that problem out. Oh, I don't have Tinder? Oh shit. Well, <laughs> some condition loss here. So we do this real quick. Don't have accelerant or anything. Fire. 
Oh my god. Why didn't that work? I don't know, Astrid, but you've got one piece of tinder now and it better work. Or we'll be running to camp office. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh boy! Oh boy! Oh boy! Uh, do we run or do we try and make tinder? Like... Jeez Louise. This is how quickly things can turn, my friends. I actually think making tinder would have been faster, but then I wouldn't have been able to make the fire very quickly. Just a snap decision there to keep the run going. I wouldn't have made it there. And making tinder would have been a poor choice, I think. Gives us a little leeway. I could potentially run the other way, to be quite honest, with all the stim. I would have probably been better to do that. Um, because now she's going to be tired and need a full sleep before I can actually travel to Trappers, which is very frustrating. You're okay. Okay, we'll try this again, shall we? <laughs> okay. Uh... You're okay, you're okay. What we're gonna do is we're gonna make some tinder plugs. We do we have any paper here that I haven't picked up? Yeah, right there. And under here. And here, so we're not in that situation again. Man, I could eat anything. <sighs> All right, I'm going to save the sticks because I think they're more useful as sticks. Um, are we basing ourselves here? I think we are, right? What's our weight? We're actually pretty light. I wonder if we should just relocate everything to trappers. Though trappers as a base is not that useful. But what am I doing here that I need to be coming back here for? So let's not... Uh, let's dump what we don't need and let's take stuff we do need with us and go to Trappers as a relocation. Place ourselves there and maybe think about going to Milton as our next step. What do I need the metal for? I guess repairing metal things, but we are going to be heavy now, but we could make a bannock with that stuff. And I think we should take the uh, peaches, etc. So yeah, let's just go. Let's just base ourselves at our trappers so that we can head to Milton because I'm like 99% sure we haven't done any of that, right? It's just been DP Coastal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Warmed up in here finally, that's good. It's been a bit warm in the last few days. I'm not in a full winter yet, so I'm a little bit dreading my uh, power bill, but hey.
bit of a strange few days. My, uh, unfortunately, five years ago, my father passed away. And yesterday was the five year, uh, that five year anniversary. So Thursday, I had a nice lunch with my family. Um, and yesterday I had lunch again with my mother so that she wasn't alone on the day. And then last night I was supposed to go around and have a glass of wine with her, but she was too tired, so she went to bed. Um, I, uh, I had a steak and wine in his honour, though I had my steak medium rare and my husband, my, uh, my father liked it well done because there was something deeply, deeply wrong with his taste buds, apparently. Uh, but yeah. It was really nice. My husband was very sweet making that for me. But yeah, bit of a strange couple of days. One second. Sorry about that. My husband needed to ask me a question and I actually needed to pay attention and answer it and take a couple of minutes to text him back. I didn't want you guys to sit there waiting awkwardly. Taking my son to swimming, uh, but he wants to go to the supermarket afterwards and he wanted to ask me about dinner and blah, 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 blah. So. Right, now that we have a pot and a skillet, there's really no excuse for me being out of water right now, but hey. We could do that at Trappers. It's currently a helicopter over my home, I don't know why. I do live near a hospital, so it's probably, probably that reason. I'll never get over how different the world feels on this mode. It's so peaceful. Uh, but it's also... It's so strange. There's a real surrealness to a map like this, which has been made with inhabitants in mind to be devoid of life. So quiet. Apart from the goddamn crows, of course. You're okay, Astrid. I'll get you to trappers before you freeze, okay? What's dead over there, though? They're a dead guy, maybe? I don't remember a deer being by, by uh, Deadfall. Perhaps Lee, perhaps Lee, I haven't got any words out of my mouth correctly today. Uh, perhaps uh, there is a body that I've forgotten about. I don't want to sprain. I was trying not to sprint because she's so tired, but I really don't want to sprain, so. Of course, the weather is changing. Surrounded by snow and nothing to drink. <laughs> It's funny, I always come up this way so that I can check the bear, check the cave. 
look for anything else and uh on this mode it's just nothing to see except the incoming blizzard Wee! yeah i know you only had three hours of sleep so I'm not surprised that you're a little bit tired astrid Here we are. You're okay, Astrid, I promise. I'll take it. Uh, in a bit. Ninety-five percent. It's always good. That's why books are so useful. Oh my gosh. Oh. All right. We're gonna eat one of those cans of peaches so she has some hydration. Uh, new bit of peaches, nice. And then we will sleep while this water cooks. So that we stop losing health. Bloop, 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 bloop. So that'll be the uh, skillet water, I think. Yeah. Can I cook a bannock? I can. Alright, so we're all good. We're all good. Let's do another leader. Do another hour. Yep. why you pick up every stick you find my friends so we're stocked you know with water uh-huh I should do the safe Two or three. Wow, okay. Well, that makes oops, I shouldn't have done that. <laughs> that makes life easier. If you can uh have them really close together. Two fifty-nine. And now it'll be halfway around, I bet you. Oh, 
Almost went past it. Well, the accelerant will be useful. <laughs> Anything green, it's all cured, right? Yeah. I wonder if I can drop any of this gear. You kind of need to keep your tinder with you for, uh, like, failures, you know? Fire failures. gonna do porridge and bannocks and then we're gonna sleep and then it's uh we're leaving in the morning nice party meal I thought I could just... I didn't know you had to discard. Interesting. I was thinking I... would be able to just go out of it and add more fuel on and then go back to cooking it. But I have to relight the whole fire, which Come is on. annoying. I need to start looking out for Maglens days too. And uh, lighting a fire just to have... You know... A fire lit and carry that, that free match around with us, you know. Because it was so close to being done and I picked it up. Yeah, this pack is getting kind of heavy. I really don't care, Astrid, really sorry. Uh, nice full belly. Of uh, dawn. Still very early. I need to find food. Alrighty, we can sleep another hour. It's not going to help us uh, in terms of uh, healing. An hour when you do heal doesn't even help you, but it's going to help us in terms of uh, we're having full energy to carry on with our quest to survive. Alright, so I probably should make a note that there's cured stuff. 
Uh, Trappers has pure deer hides, guts, and a bunny heart made in the locker. We'll get lots of coal as we go through here. But yeah, we can go see what Melton has in store. Mystery Lake. Sure, there's other places in Mystery Lake that uh, I could have visited before I left, but I uh, can go back. Keep thinking things are cold and aren't cold. <laughs> So yeah, I think I've said this in previous episodes, but I have recently adjusted the brightness um, of my game. It's mainly for your benefit, but also it means that if I have the streaming lights in my face, I can still see where I'm going. Because uh, it obviously makes things darker, because I'm blinded a little bit. So I, uh, yeah, I've done that recently. I'm finding it extremely helpful. For example, I haven't used a light source in this cave yet. This is a particularly helpful cave though, because it's got little pockets of light as you go along your journey. So sort of guide you, but um Not my bed roll, right? Yeah. Just thinking about getting into Milton and not making the uh, mistake I made in a previous run. Wanted to be fully rested leaving trappers, so we could climb immediately if we wanted to. But yeah, I do have the bedroll if we decide. Uh, not to, for some reason. I will still go down, probably the first bit anyway. Because I want to keep my coal. <laughs> more coal than I'll need but I can drop it outside the cave and at least I uh, can get it on my way back drop half of it uh, eat something drop our cans. We'll have to make porridge in Milton though. Milton is undoubtedly going to have a lot more food. Have some clothing and I could get these cattails on my way in as well. You're okay, Astrid, you're okay. 
Oh. Okay. I'd rather get to the cave at the bottom of the rope than uh, go back to the other cave, so let's go. We might miss a cattail or two, we've just got to get down there. Perhaps I should have left the coal at the bottom of the climb so I could use it, but eh. Gotta do what you gotta do. Super easy goat this one if you don't know this one already. Uh no point climbing down into Milton. You've almost got a path here, you know. Some of it's a little bit tricky, like this bit. You kind of have to. Don't do that. <laughs> this bit you normally have to do like a hoppy hop. I like hop hop back and forth from the wall until I'm on the white, and then I usually just go down the slope. But that time I screwed it up. Obviously, the quicker you get off the indicator, the uh, less likely you are to sprain, but yeah, don't fall. Falling, uh, falling sprains bad. I'm obviously in pain now. You can hear the sound of the pain pulsing in and out. It's a fun little feature. Visually, I don't care about the pain, but I, I hate the pulse, the sound pulse in and out. It drives me crazy. And we're back to our rough condition that we were earlier on. This stuff Matches really is great though. Uh, quite often on lower difficulties there's a bedroll in here. We're warming. Okay, good. Uh, but yeah. Come on, little fire. Come on. Oh, yeah. Okay. We're going to need this rose hip shortly, but we might as well have it warm. I just took that. I just misread that altogether. Didn't select the pain. Oh well, that's fine. I just looked at it and my brain went, that one, right? And then chose, I can make rose hip pie? Ooh. Gives me a headache, but it makes me less fatigued. I don't know if the cooking time uh, is... Uh, what is this? Does this mean it helps my condition? I'm very confused. Or is that the quality it's going to be? <laughs> I don't understand what that means. Yeah, look, this condition stuff. I've never noticed those before. I think they're a cooking... Uh, a new mechanic with the cooking recipes. It's fascinating though, I've never made them before. It feels like a waste though. Uh, all it only uses a little bit of things. It just takes an hour and 12 minutes and I don't really have that right now. 
There's still a bannock, so we've got that for the road. That also takes a while, but that's okay. I'm gonna top up this fire. I was going to get a little nap in here actually before I climb, but I think I'll just drink the tea, the coffees. Let's just figure out what our inventory is at and also what our uh, energy is at once I've drunk coffees and stuff. Two more coffees. If I pick everything up, what have I got? 1.2 over. Okay. Leave that behind then. Got one already. Uh, should we use this? Oh, it doesn't make everything up. Oh, it does make everything else hot. Well, that's sneaky. I didn't realize I could put just one tea in and it would make everything else hot. That seems unfeasible, but sure. Just chug that coffee, Astrid. Should be good. What is our risk here? Oh, we've got a sprayed wrist still. Okay, well, we better fix that. We can't climb. There we go. No icons. No, uh, no ailments going on and not overburdened. I don't want to pick up anything in case it uh, <laughs> gives me too much to carry to climb. Here we are. I think nearly three quarters of condition will get me up this rope. It's not very big. Always wait a couple of seconds just to make sure she's not moving when I click it. Get tired quicker or whatever. I don't know how it works. I can't remember. I don't care. Please don't give me a detailed description in the comments about how you know, because I always just stop and make sure, like, she's not still got the fatigue meter moving three down. Because I think then you start climbing and it, you get tired quicker as you climb. I don't know. It's probably bullshit. I just always stop what I'm doing for a second before I click. Alright, we're going to get in here and we're going to call it for today. Next time we will explore Milton and see if we can keep surviving. I'm pretty impressed with how this has gone so far. Obviously I've been dancing around low condition for a while. Lower than I should be, but... Uh, yeah, I'm quite happy with how long I've lived. Oh, there was a pry bar here all along. I didn't need to climb with it. Oh, a new granola bar.
let's get this for the save and yeah i'll see you guys in a few days with some more of the record keeper and then uh some more dead world and the other series are coming along down the pipeline i just want one of these to be finished first but yeah take care my friends uh have a fantastic rest of your day and i'll talk to you soon bye 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 <laughs>